This is Ruskiet, and it's time for Lesson 21 on Russian Nouns. The topic today is furniture. You want to learn Russian, but you think it's too tough, too confusing, and all that stuff. Funny-looking letters, what's that you said? It's time to learn Russian with Ruskiet. As I alluded to before the introduction song, today's topic is furniture. Let us begin by reviewing two words that name two pieces of furniture that you already know. And those words would be stol and stool. Now it may surprise you just a little bit to find out that the word in Russian for desk is the same as the word for table. Both of them are stol. Now let us proceed to the new words for this lesson. First of all, we have the word for furniture, and that word would be mebiel. So just remember that the theme for today's lesson is furniture, and the Russian word for furniture is mebiel. Probably most of you have couches in your living rooms, or at least from time to time you sit down on a couch for one reason or another. And the Russian word for couch is divan. And you've probably heard that before in various furniture stores. Divan is a Russian word for couch. Now when you go to sleep at night, you probably do so on a bed. The Russian word for bed is kravats. Kravats. And in most houses, there are several mirrors. Some of them are decorative and some of them are there to help you to straighten your hair or whatever else it is that you need to look into a mirror to do. But the word for mirror in Russian is zerkala. Zerkala. Now most of us like to flop in a nice soft fluffy armchair from time to time. The Russian word for armchair is kreslo. Kreslo. Nice fluffy soft armchair. And of course another furniture item that you might find around the typical house or office that kind of thing is a lamp. And the Russian word for lamp is very similar to the English word for lamp. The Russian word is lampa. Lampa, almost spelled the same once you account for English versus Cyrillic letters, in fact. It is now time for our phrases. But first we start with an extra word for the day. As I said, the Russian word for lamp is lampa. But there is a special word for a floor lamp. And that word would be torsher. Sounds a little bit like torture, but it's torsher. Now, if you decide to go out and buy some furniture, you will most likely go to a furniture store. The Russian word for furniture store is Mebielny Magazine. Mebielny Magazine. And of course, after you've purchased your furniture, you want to spend more time at home so you can enjoy your wonderful furniture. In which case, you may need to use this phrase every now and then. The phrase is, Ya idu damoy. And it means, I'm going home. Of course, to be with your furniture. Ya idu damoy. The end of the lesson has been reached, and so it is now time to say, Do svidanya! It's time to learn Russian with Ruski Ad.